What's up, guys? This is Chris from DraftDashboard.com. Here are my DFS picks for NBA Saturday, May 15th. These picks apply for DraftKings and FanDuel. Before I get started, please drop a like on this video and hit that red subscribe button and hit that bell icon so you don't miss our new videos. In this video, I'm going to go over my top picks for today's NBA slate. And if you stick around to the very end of this video, we'll use the draft dashboard tools to make a DFS lineup using the picks we just made. Okay guys, we have a five game slate today. So let's take a look at the point guard position. I like Cameron Payne from the Phoenix Suns playing the San Antonio Spurs who have the 10th worst defense overall and they give up the ninth most fantasy points to opposing point guards. Cameron Payne, he scored 41, 26, and 24 fantasy points in the last three games, playing 27, 21, and 20 minutes. So I think he can score 25 fantasy points or more and get you five times value or more. He's 4,500 FanDuel salary, and he's 600 less on DraftKings. So Vegas thinks there's going to be 223 points scored in this game. It's a great matchup. So I like Cameron Payne here versus the San Antonio Spurs. Okay, now here's another value play. I like Peyton Pritchard from the Boston Celtics playing the Minnesota Timberwolves, who have the second worst defense overall and they give up the fifth most fantasy points to opposing point guards. Peyton Pritchard scored 31 fantasy points in 25 minutes last game with a 23% usage rate. He's projected at 21 fantasy points here tonight. That's 5.4 times value. He's 3,900 FanDuel salary, and he's 100 less on DraftKings. So Vegas thinks there's going to be 229.5 points scored in this game. It's a fantastic matchup. So I like Peyton Pritchard here versus the Minnesota Timberwolves. Okay, let's take a look at the shooting guard position. Now on FanDuel, I like Devin Booker from the Phoenix Suns playing the San Antonio Spurs, who have the 10th worst defense overall and they give up the eighth most fantasy points to opposing shooting guards. Devin Booker has averaged 37.1 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 34 minutes per game with a 33% usage rate. He scored 23, 44, and 30 fantasy points in the last three games, playing 35, 39, and 35 minutes. He's projected at 38 fantasy points here tonight, and on FanDuel, that's 5.2 times value. He's 7,300 FanDuel salary, and he's 1,200 more on DraftKings. So I love that FanDuel price. He scored 28, 52, 48, and 55 fantasy points in his last four games versus the Spurs. Vegas thinks there's going to be 223 points scored in this game. It's a good matchup, so I like Devin Booker here versus the San Antonio Spurs. Okay guys, it's time to announce the winner of our $100 weekly PayPal giveaway. And the winner is Dan Kelly. Dan Kelly, congratulations. You are the winner of this week's $100 PayPal giveaway please reply to our comment to collect your prize. Before I continue with the picks, I'm excited today because we added a new contest for everyone watching. If you want to enter the drawing for $100 PayPal, all you need to do is like this video, hit that subscribe button, and make a quick comment below to be entered into the drawing. We'll reply to a random comment and let you know that you won, and then we'll send you $100 PayPal. So it's that easy, and we pick a new winner every Saturday and announce them in our video. So get your comment in now so I can add another entry for you. Now guys, just as a quick note, we just released a free DFS contest on Draft Dashboard for MLB and NBA for DraftKings and FanDuel. There's over $500 available in the prize pool. 
And this is a totally free contest you can enter as a draft dashboard member. So make sure to click the link in the description of this video, give draft dashboard a try, and you can start playing in our free DFS contest and compete to win some money. Okay, another shooting guard that I like, I think he makes a fantastic DraftKings play, but I play him on both sides. I like Alec Burks from the New York Knicks playing the Charlotte Hornets, who have the ninth worst defense overall, and they give up the 12th most fantasy points to opposing shooting guards. Alec Burks has averaged 23.1 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 26 minutes per game with a 22% usage rate. But he scored 46 fantasy points last game in 34 minutes with a 32% usage rate. So I think he can score 30 fantasy points or more here and get you five times value or more. He's 5,000 fan duel salary and he's 1,100 less on DraftKings. So I love that DraftKings price. Vegas thinks there's going to be 212.5 points scored in this game. And he scored 31 fantasy points in his last game versus the Hornets. So I like Alec Burks here versus the Charlotte Hornets. Okay, let's take a look at the small forward position. I like Evan Fournier from the Boston Celtics playing the Minnesota Timberwolves, who have the second worst defense overall, and they give up the third most fantasy points to opposing small forwards. Evan Fournier has averaged 29 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 30 minutes per game with a 23% usage rate. He scored 29, 45, and 49 fantasy points in the last three games, playing 34, 36, and 35 minutes. Now, I think he can score 35 fantasy points or more here and get you five times value or more. He's 7,100 FanDuel salary, but he's 900 less on DraftKings. So I love that DraftKings price. Vegas thinks there's going to be 229.5 points scored in this game. And he did score 32 fantasy points in his last game versus the Timberwolves. It's a fantastic matchup. So I like Evan Fournier here versus the Minnesota Timberwolves. Okay, another small forward that I like is RJ Barrett from the New York Knicks playing the Charlotte Hornets, who have the ninth worst defense overall, and they give up the 12th most fantasy points to opposing small forwards. RJ Barrett, he's averaged 30.2 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 35 minutes per game with a 24% usage rate. He scored 43, 18, and 40 fantasy points in the last three games, playing 40, 37, and 44 minutes. So he's playing monster minutes, and I think he can score 33 fantasy points or more here and get you five times value or more. He's 6,600 fan duel salary, and he's 100 more on DraftKings. Vegas thinks there's going to be 212.5 points scored in this game, so I like R.J. Barrett here versus the Charlotte Hornets. Okay, let's take a look at the power forward position. I'm going to give you a stud pick here. I like Julius Randle from the New York Knicks playing the Charlotte Hornets, who have the ninth worst defense overall, and they give up the second most fantasy points to opposing power forwards. Julius Randle has averaged 45.2 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 37 minutes per game with a 29% usage rate. He scored 49, 45, and 34 fantasy points in the last three games, playing 44, 43, and 37 minutes. So he's playing monster minutes. And he's projected at 45.3 fantasy points here tonight. That's five times value. He's 9,000 fan duel salary, and he's 700 more on DraftKings. So I prefer that FanDuel price. So we know Vegas thinks there's going to be 212.5 points scored in this game. He scored 43 fantasy points in his last game versus the Hornets. It's a good matchup. So I like Julius Randle here versus the Charlotte Hornets. 
Real quick, guys, I got great news. For a limited time, we're offering a full 30-day trial to Draft Dashboard. You can try all of our DFS tools for all sports. You can try the Position Optimizer, where you can see the top players ranked for each position. And we added a new Player Trends tool, where you can see the top salary differences between FanDuel and DraftKings. It's a really good tool to help you pick out value for the site that you're playing on. Oh, and if you're tired of doing research every day, we just added a cheat sheet that shows hand-picked plays for the slate. No confusing stat lines, no headaches, just a simple cheat sheet that shows the absolute best players for your lineups. Okay, another power forward that I like is Nicholas Claxton from the Brooklyn Nets playing the Chicago Bulls, who have a middle of the pack defense overall and they're middle of the pack defending opposing power forwards. Nicholas Claxton, he scored 30, 30, and 18 fantasy points in the last three games, playing 22, 23, and 13 minutes. He had a 29% usage rate last game, and I think he can score 20 fantasy points or more here and get you five times value or more. He's 3,900 FanDuel salary, and he's 600 less on DraftKings. I like this pick because Vegas thinks there's going to be 234 points scored in this game, and he scored 30 fantasy points in his last game versus the Bulls. So I like Nicholas Claxton here versus the Chicago Bulls. Okay, moving on to the center position. I like Andre Drummond from the LA Lakers playing the Indiana Pacers, who have the fifth worst defense overall, and they give up the fourth most fantasy points to opposing centers. Andre Drummond has averaged 37 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 27 minutes per game with a 28% usage rate. He scored 36, 47, and 19 fantasy points in the last three games, playing 21, 35, and 19 minutes. He's projected at 34.9 fantasy points here tonight. That's 5.5 times value. He's 6,400 FanDuel salary, and he's 200 more on DraftKings. So Vegas thinks there's going to be 227.5 points scored in this game. And he scored 36, 43, 14, and 63 fantasy points in his last four games versus the Pacers. It's a great matchup. So I like Andre Drummond here versus the Indiana Pacers. Okay, another center that I like. I'm going to give you a value play here. I like Nerlens Noel from the New York Knicks playing the Charlotte Hornets, who have the ninth worst defense overall and they're middle of the pack defending opposing centers. Nerlens Noel has averaged 22.3 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 24 minutes per game with a 9% usage rate. He scored 21, 13, and 20 fantasy points in the last three games, playing 26, 24, and 26 minutes. He's projected at 23.2 fantasy points here tonight. That's 5.7 times value. He's 4,100 FanDuel salary, and he's 100 less on DraftKings. He scored 28, 18, and 24 fantasy points in his last three games versus the Hornets, and Vegas thinks there's going to be 212.5 points scored in this game. So I like Nerlens Noel here versus the Charlotte Hornets. If you want to try all these daily fantasy tools for yourself, click the link in the description below this video or just go to draftdashboard.com. You can use our DFS lineup optimizer to build quality lineups using our picks and your own custom player pool. Click the link in the description below this video and try all these daily fantasy tools right now. Thanks so much for watching. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit that bell icon so you can get instant updates whenever we post a new video. Thank you so much for watching everyone. If you enjoyed this video, please smickety smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Oh, and please comment below with your favorite player for this NBA slate. I love to hear what you guys have to think. Thanks again and good luck.